wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This game, of course, being brought to you from one of the most recognisable grounds in the British Isles. It is, of course, Ibrox. profile high caliber teams this is a welcome event for all these supporters but on the face of it peter we would appear to have a high caliber meeting with very little at stake but then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in and this becomes a big incentive it changes the dynamic so there's plenty at stake for them which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest Things on the way. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Kevin De Bruyne. He's just one of the best strikers of the ball you'll ever see. And that applies just as much to his passing game as Cristiano Ronaldo! There it is! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal too is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge and long may that continue. And that is stunning. Just too hot to handle. And the contact was fantastic. Right on the bootlaces and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved, he gave it everything he had. That has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you'll take back again. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo really just 
wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Cedric Suarez drives it forward. It's put paid to a promising move. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, shooting chance! It short. Neymar goes for goal. Party gets rid without sophistication. Nice touch. And the shot. He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's, that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's, it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Messi. And it's Messi. Just brushed off the ball there. Be the final action of the first half. Well, it has been an even contest as the score lines. Arsenal get the ball rolling for the second period. Manchester City playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this score line, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Has a pop! So close to what would have been a memorable goal. He was set on rounding it off in fitting style, but he couldn't make it fit. Alaba. Alaba plays it towards the front. A chance to play it in. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Straight forward. Shoot and the finish! And in it goes! And the comeback is complete! Oh, what a cracking goal! But a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Arsenal take the lead. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack and flair. But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. This isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. It just has to be done. The 
ball's come loose and the chase is on. Manchester City are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. And he should... It's Lacazette! An absolute thunderbolt! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! You know, thinking about that, I think they've defected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. So the lead now is two. Neymar. De Bruyne. Neymar. That will be the final act. And in the end, it got away. They just weren't allowed to build on their lead. They lost their lead, and they lost the game.